What is anistrophic filtering? Anistrophic filtering is a feature of some video cards that sharpens the details of a fading away part of a 3D object that recedes into the distance. Think of a text in the titles at the beginning of a Star Wars movie that is presented in large letters and then scrolls back into the distance. As it scrolls off, it becomes fuzzy and hard to read. In a 3D image, you may want a comparable effect to retain the sharpness of an object as it recedes. Anistrophic filtering does this. Isotrophic describes objects or image elements with vectors of equal value along different axes, such as squares and cubes. Anistrophic describes objects whose vectors are unequal, such as trapezoids and parallelograms. Since anistrophic filtering requires intense processing as image, frames are presented to the display. It may affect performance. A user may want to weigh the perceived improvement in visual quality against the effect on performance. On the right side, you might see some images with anistrophic filtering off and on. Here is an example of an image with anistrophic filtering off and filtering on. Here is another example of AIF is on and off. So can you memorize what is anistrophic filtering AF? It is a feature of some video cards that sharpens the details of the fading away part of a 3D object that recedes into the distance. Think of the text in the titles at the beginning of the Star Wars movies that is presented in large letters and then scrolls back into the distance. Sometimes when you innovate, you make mistakes. It is best to admit them quickly and get on with improving your other innovations by Steve Jobs.